This is potassium permanganate, and it's one of my all-time favorite chemicals. Let me show you why. Now farmers use potassium permanganate to treat their water and sterilize it. As a survivalist uh, in the wild, we can use potassium permanganate to do the exact same thing. All you want to do is grab your knife and get literally two to three crystals onto the end of it. See this amount that I've got on the end here, that is too much. This is probably enough to sterilize the water. Now all I need to do is take the end of my knife with the crystals on it and put it into the water. Now potassium permanganate is a salt, so if you put too much in, it can be harmful. And you can see now how the potassium permanganate is turning the water a light pinkish color. You can see at the bottom the crystals are dissolving. I want to keep stirring. So theoretically this water should be sterile now. Tastes pretty good to me. Let me show you some other cool uses for potassium permanganate. Simply by adding more crystals to the water turning it a more purple color, a more dense purple. This, if you poured it over athlete's foot or other fungal infections, uh, will help cure or heal them. A small amount of potassium permanganate will kill all the germs in the water. A large amount like this turns potassium permanganate into an antiseptic. So if you get a cut or a, a graze in the bush, just pour this over that and it, it will act exactly like an antiseptic killing all the germs around that wound. Also with this kind of coloration of purple, if you pour this in the snow, uh, if, if you're lost, uh, just spell out the word SOS. Because it's so purple and uh, visible, uh, helicopters can see that really easily, which gives potassium permanganate a use in rescue. All right, now comes the fun part. Mix potassium permanganate with this, which is glycerin. This is actually homemade glycerin, and you get fire. Come and have a look. So the funny thing about glycerin is that you can just mix it with nitric acid to make nitroglycerin, but at a pharmacy it costs about $5 for a bottle this size. This potassium permanganate was about $6. Uh, I got this online. And if you mix them together, Now you can do this with antifreeze as well because that is also a glycol. If you put too much glycerin on, uh, this doesn't really work. You need to kind of stir it up a little bit. Now, potassium permanganate can also be mixed with sugar. Um, you need to use a lot of friction to get it to work. I need to add a little bit more permanganate. Oh, that was too much. So as you can see, it can be used as a really excellent fire starter in a survival situation. Still warm. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Remember to like if you want to see more, comment on what I should do next, and subscribe so you don't miss out. See you guys later.